So Pelican claims the backpacks are waterproof. I am about to test it. The backpack, actually the fabric bag itself made around plastic case. I am not worried about uh, glue to be softened after uh, some time in the water because actually there is no glue and the fabric is screwed to the, by the metal frame directly to the plastic case here is the case itself as you can see here there is a rubber ceiling and uh, here the plastic edge which is going uh, in a close contact with this foam and makes a waterproof seal which we are going to test on the other side of the back fabric also the same plastic frame with uh, dozens of screws it is just screwed so no any glue and uh, I'm not worried that any glue will become melted I will put in the waterproof compartment I will also put here I will check You must always close until they are nice click It's also closed and for this test I will make sure that velcro and at the bottom is also open never wet so I spray this uh, never wet all around the brick so the sides also here but anyway let's test case is uh, well and For some timing, I will set my stopwatch. Six and a half minutes. Now it's nine and a half minutes. Now eleven minutes. Before I some water repellent spray, which is never wet to the fabric part of the bag and also to the inside like here so if, as you can see the water is just running out easily surface previously sprayed by never wet 20 minutes 40 seconds I believe guys you still with me test is not yet over almost half an hour please don't get me wrong I'm shooting on my 2016 ASOS it stops shooting at some point it is too big so you see the video is interrupted, but not my test. I'm recording 
58 minutes and uh, I want to put your attention over here here is the valve so no any air bubbles coming out means the valve is waterproof and water cannot ingress through the valve I am coming to the one hour of test I will drain my best and later I will open the inside of the waterproof case and we will see my stopwatch of let me one hour so the water has been drained my test took me one hour and three minutes that's enough I will take the towel okay. be sure that the water from outside will not go inside it was my Nokia smartphone paper towel napkin and some copy paper And what can we see? I have some water ingress over here and at that corner. So my paper towel is a little bit wet. Nokia smartphone is I don't know, it's not wet. Works fine. No oh, any water. Okay. It's dry. Copy paper. Just a little bit wet over here. And the back itself. See, around the corners, seal itself. And you see what the drops. Fair to say that uh, this bag will be waterproof for uh, less than one hour. I think it can withstand the uh, raining time for uh, half an hour, no problem, but... Honestly, I'm a little bit disappointed. I expected this to be completely waterproof. As it was claimed by Pelican. But... What can I do? And for the rest part of the test, for the part with never wet spray, it was applied inside here it was applied over here it was also applied over here so you can see the fabric is not completely soaked now you can open the part over here inside here Quite well. Yeah, by the way, this bag is around two years with me, and this is the first ever time I put this bag to a water test. I mainly use the bag for traveling. I have a 15 inch MacBook from 2015, and I bought this bag. Back especially for a purpose to keep my MacBook as safe as possible. Make 
sure it will not be damaged in airport during traveling. In a baggage, in luggage compartment, whatever. I am satisfied with the physical protection. My phone has not suffered after one hour being underwater to make the test really fail. I hope it was useful for you once you want to ask me how else I use this bag, what are the features, what are pros and cons. You are always welcome, make some comments, show me some support and we will see what Pelican will reply me about this bag. I'm going to send them a message and link to my video and once they reply me then I can make another video. And bye everyone.